Hey everyone, this is Jansen Richard. Uh, thanks for coming to jansenrichard.com. Uh, give you guys a little online lesson today. Uh, what I just showed you is an exercise that I come up with, uh, basically for doing uh, Swiss triplets. And for all of you who don't know what a Swiss triplet is, uh, you know, just to break it down, essentially it's like playing. It's a triplet pattern, and you're playing sort of right, right, left, except the first note is a flam. So it's like flam, right, left. Flam right left, flam right left, flam right left, flam right left. So it's like right right left, but there's a flam on the first note. And if, because it's a pattern in three, um, you can play with your left hand as well too. So it's the left hand one. So should you the right one? And there's left side too. And the thing is that I, I really struggle, I mean, whichever one is your dominant hand, whether you're a righty or a lefty, um, that's usually one that's going to be a lot stronger with. I'm, because I'm right-handed, play, you know, right-handed Swiss triplets a lot easier than I play left-handed Swiss triplets. But it's really important that you want to, you know, you want to focus on both of them um, and strengthen it up. You know, you don't want to focus all on the right hand or on your dominant hand. If you're a lefty, you want to be playing left-handed Swiss triplets all the time. So the exercise that I showed you there um, was just a little thing for basically coming up with you know transitioning between the two and the way it works is that you basically play you can start off either with the left hand or the right hand but you play I mean I'll start with the right hand here and what you want to do is play basically two Swiss triplets so like and then play three alternating flams so like right left right and then play two left-handed flams or two left-handed Swiss triplets sorry so and then transition back to it. So essentially, uh, when you start off, we'll do the two Swiss triplets. Transition. Left, right, left, right, 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 left, right, left, 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 right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left, 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 right, left. When you get it up to speed, you know, you're working, equally working your right-handed flams and your left-handed flams as well. Your right-handed Swiss triplets and your left-handed Swiss triplets. So you can get it going pretty fast too. Like. So that's just a quick demonstration of uh, how you can do right-handed Swiss triplets and left-handed Swiss triplets in one easy exercise. Take it easy, and thanks again for coming.